Well, Christmas is over. They stopped playing Christmas music on the radio. I noticed this morning at 5.30 there was no Christmas music. To me, that's telling me Christmas is over. But I've had a few requests. People have asked me, Bob, what did you get for Christmas? We want to see what you got for Christmas. So I said, okay, I'll make a video. I know you're all bored out there. So I thought I'd cheer you all up and show you what I got for Christmas. Now, I'll try not to make the video too long. I may mention a couple of names, but if I mention names and talk about everything, I'll make, you know, the video too long. So let's get started, okay? This is a 22 inch monitor TV. Still in the box. Haven't opened it up yet. Yeah, from Kelly. That's from Kelly and Christine, my two daughters. That's to replace my old one I got here. That's 17 inch. This one, this one's 22 inches. Um, a snowman. And you open it up and you get money in it. That's towards my new camera I'm going to get to replace this camera I have now. A scarf. There you go. A new scarf. The dad from Kelly and Dave. Fifty bucks. Dad towards new video camera. So more money towards the video camera. I got the new camera. Socks. Shrolls. Doctor Shrolls socks for diabetics. Yes, there's one, two, three, four pair. Yeah, so I wear them on my feet, you know. Diabetic socks. Darth Vader piddle. Sitting on the couch or whatever. And a blanket. A throw a little a little throw blanket that you can put over you. Put over your legs, cover you up. You know, so yeah, a blanket. Some Blu rays. The Avengers Endgame. Star Wars, The Rise of Skywalker. Toy Story 4. Bohemian Rhapsody. Captain Marvel. The artist, and a Blu-ray set box, I guess, or whatever they call it, or not a box. Tom Cruise, Mission Impossible, six movie collection on Blu-ray. Six movies, all on Blu-ray. You gotta love it. You gotta love it, people. A nice box. 
with a car on a truck I should say and inside 70% chocolate the kind that I like and a Mickey Mouse For your books, a marker, so you know where you are when you're reading your book. Johnny Cash Cup, the man in black. The man in black. Kelly and Christine USB three button optical a mouse to replace my old one that I got here that gives me a hard time sometimes but a new mouse a new nutcracker A new nut crack. Mandalorian, 12 posters. Hey, Georgette, look. It's Baby Yoda. 12 posters. That should be fun. Justice League Batman Pez. Justice League Superman Pez. Put soap in it, set it on your sink in your bathroom or wherever, wherever you wash your hands at or want to wash your hands at. Yeah, it's full of soap. It'll push the button on top. And it's got a record player on it and some albums. Yeah. Christine Kirby, King of the Comics by Mark Ebener. Introduction by Neil Gaiman. This is very good. Very good. Big Barda. All kinds of interesting stuff in this book. Yeah, I'll be reading this one soon. Yep. <clears throat> iTunes. An iTunes card. More chocolate. Chocolate. 72% cocoa. Yeah, you snap off a little crack of this and you go to bed at night and read your comic book and chew on some chocolate. A notebook. You know, just it's just a notebook. Yep. Yeah.
I got it to write my notes and any stories or anything I want to write down. You know, if I tell stories, I write them in here. I write poems, whatever I do. Keep track of things. Nice little bag. Sometimes I get stuck. Oh, there it is. Georgette. Can you see that? Baby Yoda. Star Wars, The Mandalorian, The Child. I don't know if you can see it, but yeah. I, I keep them in the box. Go Leafs, go! A new t-shirt, shirt, whatever they call it, the long sleeves. Yeah, Leaf, I'm a Leaf fan from way back, years and years and years ago. Letter to you, Bruce Springsteen. Yep, I think Kelly got me that. I forget sometimes. Got so much stuff, sometimes I forget who I got it from. It's because I'm old. <laughs> Just kidding. Yeah. This is for the bottom of your feet. You know, you rub this on the bottom of your feet and get your circulation going. You know, it's good for you. Star Wars. Oh, you can see the reflection on my computer. Uh, there's a lamp up there. Anyway, this is Star Wars, The Mandalorian, The Child, a 16-month calendar. Double reflection this morning. I shouldn't say this morning. It's 20 after 12, so... It's afternoon here. Yeah. Hanging up on my wall. Yep. A pillowcase, a Batman pillowcase. I have another Batman pillowcase. I got this one from my grandson, Eddie. Eddie gave me this. He gave me the one, I, the other one I have. So a couple of years, I think it was last year or the year before, he gave me a pillowcase. So I asked, I said to him, where's the other one? He said, the other one? I go, yeah, the other one. I said, this is only, this is only one. I got two pillows. So <laughs> this year he gave me this one. Thanks, Ed. <laughs> Soap to wash my body with. What you, what's that soap? What do they call that soap? Yeah, soap. What they call it. But anyway, it's, it's soap. It's good for you. From Cena, Koshi, or Fred. That's dogs and the gecko. Pepperoni stick. Pepperoni stick. Yep. 
I like pepperoni sticks. Who doesn't like pepperoni sticks? Nah, way on those things. Turtle, hot chocolate. Rich! Hot chocolate. For that, you know, that big cup I got? That big bowl cup from Ch Chanel, my granddaughter. Yeah, it's about, about up, but not chocolate in it. And three little chocolates. You can eat one of these one day, but you can't eat all three in one day. It's not a good idea. You can eat chocolate, but you can't go overboard and all those candies and stuff. It's not good for you. So yeah, one of these, you have know, one one day and you're fine. All right, let's see what else I got. Look at this. I got a present here. It's not even open, so I was going to share with you guys. You want to see what's in it? Who's the two? I better make sure I get the right one. Oh, it's Bob from Santa. That's me. <coughs> the Bob from Santa. See what it is. Huh? It's a Bob from Santa. Game of Thrones, number 79. What's her name? Era? A R Y A? Era Stark? That little girl, that little one? Yeah, I like her. I don't know. I thought she was the best thing in Game of Thrones. I don't know why, I just think so. All the people in Game of Thrones thought she was the, I don't know, the best one. Or what do you want to call it? She uh, interested me. She was something else, that little girl. Yeah. A Funko Pop. I don't have any of these. No, nope. I only got two, two and these two, so that's four. I'm not really, you know, I mean, I like Funko Pops, but can't get into that. One here and there, once in a while, yeah. And I got another one here, present. The Bob from Santa Claus. Let's see what this one, oh. This one is Harry Potter, 44, Ron Weasley, Weasley, yeah, Harry Potter, I wouldn't mind getting Harry Potter ones, but this is Ron Weasley, Remus, Ron Weasley, Hermione, Harry, Ginny, Luna, Luna Lovegood, and Peter Pettigrew, well anyway, this is uh, Ron Weasley. Yeah. So that's good. That's good for a lot. Yeah, it's like I said, I only got, uh, when I got this hat too. Kelly and Christine. And the last thing. <coughs> poker set. Poker set. You all know what a poker set is. Right? Thing is heavy too, man. See? It's heavy. It's got all those chips in it and stuff. See? Chips and cards. Take that with me when I go away on the weekends with my brothers, Donnie and Sammy. Get out there and smoke some dope and play cards, play poker, drink a little bit, not much, a little bit. That's it. All right, let's put this back in here. That's it. I got a... Um, a few graphic novels, you know, DC and Marvel graphic novels, but uh, I said, nah, I don't, don't want to make this video too long. So I got some of them too. So there you go, that's what I got for Christmas, and I think that's everything. 
I think that's everything I got. I want to thank everybody for my Christmas presents. Thank Santa Claus, and I hope you all enjoyed that video. And uh, hopefully I'll be around next year for Santa Claus to bring me more presents. But we all know people. That the main thing about Christmas is it was rough this year to be, you know, he's, I miss my Harrison Christmas party, right, that we usually have in November. There's 35 or 50 of us get together. My brothers, sisters, their family, you know. All, there's all kinds of us Harrisons, right? There's like, well, you, I don't know, 35 at least or more. And we get together around the end of November and we have a Christmas party. You know, we have turkey and the whole, everything, give out presents, play games, listen to Christmas and everything. Well, we didn't do that this year. First time in, oh, probably first time in 50 years. Yep. Started doing it when, I think started doing it when I was, well, maybe not 50 years, but almost 50 years. I think we started doing it uh, a long while, a while ago. Well, let's put it this way, years ago, okay, because my mom and dad had a house. They had six kids, right? And then we all got married and we all had kids. So we all couldn't end up at my mother and father's house all at the same time, right? It was almost impossible. So we used to stagger the days, you know, your turn and then my turn. And then, you know, we all had turns. And then that didn't work out too well because that went on too long. So then my mom and dad got the bright idea. They rented a hall. So we rented a hall. We all ended up at a hall, all of us. So... That's what we do now. We have a hall, a big hall. We rent that, and that's what we do for Christmas. But like I said, we didn't do that this year, and we really haven't seen too many people this year. You know, talking on Facebook and stuff. Yeah, but uh, you know, the only ones I did see, I think, this year was probably Donnie and Sammy on a long weekend. So other than that, I haven't seen anybody for a while. You know, I see Kelly and Christine they're upstairs. Bubble or whatever they call it, but anybody else? No, I haven't seen anybody. Anyway, I wish everybody a Merry Christmas, and I wish they did have a Merry Christmas. And you know, hug your family, you know, your bubble, I guess, you know, do your best. Yeah, so Christmas is all about your family, and if you get a present right, you're lucky. Yeah, my daughters love me, right? So. I'm their dad. Go Leafs, go!